Marcus Rashford down with an injury. Manchester United players seem to be dropping like flies at the moment. In the Man United versus Real Betsis game that is going on right now, it's currently 3-2. Marcus Rashford went down with a little knock. And yeah, man, he looked like he was holding on to that ankle, that right ankle. Um, he did get stepped on in the box. Real Betis, it should have been a penalty call. Referee didn't call, but he clearly stepped on Rashford's ankle. And yeah, man, man, injury after injury after injury. A little knock for Rashford. He got up, he got up kind of gingerly. Um, he tried to, he was limping off the field a little bit. He limped it off. Um, obviously, there's a tweet over here saying that he's fine now, but he did get stepped on on his ankle. So could that present to be a problem in the future if he has any more ankle issues or whatever? Because he did get stepped on pretty good in the penalty box. The guy was going for a challenge to win the ball. He missed the ball. He stepped on Rashford's ankle. And it's funny because in the first half, the Ahmed Diallo penalty call that was given wasn't a penalty. It was a very, very soft call. He, he went down with nothing. But this right here where Rashford actually gets trotted on in the box and gets stepped on, on his foot pretty good. It's not given as a penalty. Very inconsistent from these referees. I, I rest my case. It, it is what it is, man. It is what it is. I, I've, I've been talking about refs nonstop, but the referee inconsistency is absolutely ridiculous. Now, this right here, obviously with the Marcus Rashford injury, brings me on to another injury that we got to talk about. Official Manchester United confirmed Lenny Euro, the new center back on the block that just got in five minutes ago. He just got into the team. He is going to be out for three months with a foot. Three months. When I saw him on the boot and crutches, I was like, yeah, that's going to be at least two months. I saw him on the boot and crutches. I was like, man, it, it could be even more. Because who knows, man? Like I said, dude, he just got here. He just got in the team. And he's going to be out for three months. Three months. Rasmus Hoyland out for six weeks with a hamstring issue. It's like, damn, man, right before I'm about to go down to South Carolina and see them play, man. It's, it's crazy. I feel like if I wasn't going, nobody would be injured. But but you know what? You can't, you, can't, you can't legislate stuff like this. But it's like, damn, right before I'm about to go down to South Carolina and see these guys play for the first time, seeing it live. And they're going to be playing Liverpool, too, which is great. After Salah is going to be there, a few other Liverpool players. Like, yeah, man. It's like, damn, right before then, we got players dropping, man. You got Rashford with his little knock. Who knows if he's going to get be put in on Saturday because they might sit him down because he's got this little ankle thing. Even though he got back up and walked it off, he's still got he. – I'm telling you, if you go look at the clip of, of him dribbling into the box, he, he definitely got trotted on good. They stepped on his foot pretty good on the side of that ankle. Um, I'm not sure if it was the left or right ankle. I think it was the left. No, it was, I think it was the right ankle because he was dribbling on his right foot. But, yeah, man, unbelievable. Let me know what y'all think down below, man. It's crazy. Absolutely crazy. All the best for Lenny Yoro, Hoyland, Rashford. But, man, I mean, just getting in and right off the bat five minutes. Like, he ain't even been in. He ain't even, he ain't even really, like, got in green. He hasn't done anything. He's had, like, one or two training sessions, played against Arsenal in a preseason game, and, bam, out for three months. That's crazy, man. That's crazy. But and he came in for a big fee too. Sixty what was it? Like sixty million? And he's out. So yeah, we'll see what Man United do. Like I said, um I don't know if they're gonna push it back and try to get him back sooner. Obviously he's under contract and stuff. They might try to get him back in sooner. They're gonna try to get him in as soon as possible. They want these guys playing. So we'll see, man. Let me know what you think down below. I'm gonna wrap it up here. It's speaking with you guys, and I'm out.